What's up everybody? Today we have a reaction video. Well, last night on Australia dropped their Wonder Woman 1984 trailer. And uh, well, we all know that Wonder Woman 1984 had a lot of problems, a lot of plot holes, a lot of things that is just, didn't make much sense. Um, so I am really, really looking forward to this on its trailer. So without further ado, let's just get ready and check this out. All right, two, three, and bam. Almost a year without a major DC or Marvel release, AT&T delivered a blockbuster spectacle right when we wished for it the most. Oh! I renounce my wish! Wonder Woman 1984. Yeah, I kind of like that, but did that renounce it after take on Wonder Woman, set against the backdrop of World War I, will skip to the 80s for no reason and crank up the wacky hijinks, right. but also crank up the sincere romance. And while you're at it, crank up some big CGI cat fights, all while cranking up the political allegory. But don't forget to crank up the girl power yeah. after you crank through an hour of just kind of waiting for the plot to get going. No, I actually like the beginning. The Amazon part, I liked it. <laughs> yeah. Boy, this movie is a mess. Yeah. A hot mess. A hot still, mess indeed. After a trip to Flashback Island and a trip to the same mall from Stranger Things, catch up with Wonder Woman. I know, Woman. I had Stranger She's Things gone vibe. She's but... optimist to an insufferable, I don't even have a TV person. I don't have a TV. Ma'am, you have several. Wow. Yeah. Incredible. But when she comes across a magical wishing <laughs> What? I said wishing rock, not <laughs> Where would you what? get that idea? Not great, now I can't unsee it. She'll wish to hook up with Steve oh, one no, more time. I can't unsee it Not the either. real Steve Trevor, mind you. Just some random dude whose oh, body she'll man, use like a sex doll while his mind is trapped in the sunken place. How did Wonder Woman 2 end up more problematic than a Rob Schneider that movie? That was really messed up. Please, I'm Jessica. <laughs> Watch this gal take down Max Lord, a blonde-haired, orange-tanned con man who can't be a stand-in for Donald Trump. Because this one uh, loves his really son. That, but He'll gain whatever. the wish Wang's power to make people's hair blow softly in the wind. I wish I had more help. Then go full Jafar and set off a <laughs> climax so chaotic, even the screenwriters <laughs> don't know what's happening. What the hell is going on? No one knows any more than that. I what know, no one knows what's happening in this film. Leading Wonder Woman to boldly sacrifice uh. her love to stop other people's dreams from coming true because we're all inherently selfish. And uh, bad, evil. yeah. You cannot have it all. You can only have the truth. Wow, that is grim. Are we sure the Snyders weren't more involved? Real as Diana faces a new frenemy in Barbara Minerva. She's a cute, funny, brilliant scientist who. Huh, never mind. Oh my She's god, a I just thought about another plot hole animation after the heels. video. Boo this nerd. Boo her. Nerd. Watch as she copies her whole look and character arc from that other DC nerd obsessed. I know with it's kind of a trope, isn't it? Mammals. But I, Today's I don't mind this trope, coming. to be honest. Not that one. Yeah. No, those are Disney. Come on, Catwoman. Oh my God, she looks terrible. <gasps> what? Yeah. Michelle Pfeiffer was way better. No even. There's no comparison. Come on. We haven't properly housebroken this Kyle. <laughs> Jake, I heard some people saying that, but I don't really think... I mean, I just think they're going with the trope. That's my name, Maximilian. I love this movie, Batman you Returns. Look love it. Amazing. But no matter how exciting it is to watch CG Gal Gadot drown a Jellicle, most of the film is them fighting the real bad guy of the movie. Bad guys. Come on, let me walk you home. I know, home. Right? I mean, this hey, kind of happens a lot when you're hey, walking on the street, but... Oh, thank you. I think they overdid it a little bit. Hey, babe, where are you going? Ooh, you're pretty. Wow. You slow down, so sexy. Much. I've had my eyes on you for some time. Anything else I can get you? Tea? Me? Don't cat call women, you guys. They'll literally turn into a cat and fight you. <laughs> so enjoy a classic be careful what you wish for story. Except that no one actually knew they were making a real wish, so who cares? That you likely watch from the comfort of your own I couch. I love that you scene with the, 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 the Pop-Tarts that handy was in. You have to Google, that was funny. what are Wonder Woman's powers again? I know, right? Invisible. I was so confused too. have only done it once. Haven't subway trains been around since the 1800s? Yes, but come on, not this type of tra no, train. And eventually, how to cancel HBO Max free trial. I can't believe we killed the theater industry for this. Oh, man. Starring. 
Amazon Wishlist, MC Scat Cat. <laughs> Durr, what's a trash can? Durr. I was good, but I can be better. <laughs> a Washington so true. DC tours and video. I was good, but it can no be better. God. I love that. I found my happy thought. Oh and man! The original principal <laughs> powers so from Sky High. Oh man, I love Sky High. Cheetahs never prosper. Gosh, that was that it. was the crown a more exciting series about a Princess Diana. Yeah. New Year, same old honest. Unfortunately, they really messed up. Oh wow! Yes, uh, there's a couple of things here that I thought it was spot on. You know, it was a really funny one. I love the Mandalorian little nod. You know, I can be good. No, but I'm good, but it can be better. Something like that. And then you see the Mandalorian. That's totally true. Uh, pretty, pretty, pretty funny. Amazing stuff. But while I was watching this video, I even thought about something else that I don't think I mentioned on my review. Uh, why was she wearing the golden suit? I mean, I get that she had, usually they wear that. I, I think in the, in the comic books, it was to finding something that uh, it was close to her level, like a godlike character. But first and foremost, she didn't even know that Barbara had turned into a cat, right? <laughs> or, or cheetah. She didn't know that. And also, she, she hadn't really lost her powers by then. She was full on because she renounced her wish. So, why was she wearing the suit? I just thought of this now while watching this, but wow. Now, I don't think that uh, Cheetah was uh, the same thing as um, Catwoman, just because it's not even fair to compare them, because Catwoman is a much superior character, in my opinion, just because I just love that film, and I think Michelle Pfeiffer was the best Catwoman, so I don't really see that, but I do see the trope of the you know uh, the loser turning into villain because we have seen that in many in many many films. Apart from that, I think they were spot on. Now seriously, hilarious. But anyways, guys, uh, this is my reaction. Drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think of the honest trailers. Uh, take on the Wonder Woman 1984. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe for more.